up every morning and tell myself Good morning, gorgeous Sometimes you gotta look in the mirror and say Good morning, gorgeous No one else can make me feel this way Hi everyone, um, welcome back to my channel So I wanted to come up and give you an update on my new install for Microlux with extension How long it took um, what are my impressions on them and what uh, challenges I'm having so far so I I installed them a week ago last week Sunday I started it the Sundays it took two the Sunday the, the Saturday I mean the Saturday the Sunday and a little part of Monday to or Tuesday then didn't do anything Monday Tuesday to just to finish up and um, finish pushing on the, the curly ends and so I had a goal of 500 locks I did not get 500 I got 407 however I still feel I'm going to reach that goal and let me tell you why so while I'm pleased with the final results of the hair and I think that they're really really beautiful um, I did not have them installed myself this time because I really needed the help with the parting before as I told you when I did them um, the parting the size of the of the of the lock of each lock varied so I had some too big some too small and then some that were like the right size that I wanted them so this time I felt let me get a professional who's gonna help me with the parting space and all of that and just the time to for me it will take me a longer time to do it but with her it took her two and a half days to get it done so we started 9 a.m. the Saturday, finished like about 1 a.m. Then we continued Sunday afternoon, like about 3.30, finished like 4 a.m. And then we didn't do anything on the Monday. But on the Tuesday, um, I went to her and she finished completing the ends that she had in. So overall, I felt like she did a very, very beautiful job. Um, my only challenge is and I'm gonna bring give you a close-up if you can see this one here so she started braiding my hair so from right here to right here this is my hair and then now from right here is where she started adding the extension so you can see already the size of of here the extension versus my my hair and i foresee problems later on as the lot grows and especially when you look at the size of the parting and trying to pull this part here when it starts to swell so i wanted um the lock size all of them to be uniform like right here so you wouldn't know like where the extension started and um where my hair started and we start stopped and where the extension started also I also wanted her to add it um, from the end from the root I mean but I never said anything and so that is um, my bad however I did start to um, to adjust to fix them myself I know it's gonna take me a minute to get it done but I'm willing to do the um, the repairs now rather than waiting until the hair starts to mature start to lock so I'm gonna turn around so you can see what it looks like from the back like i said it's very beautiful i love it my only challenge is with what i just showed you so let me show you what i've started to do because i have started um doing the repairs so i just wanted to show you what i've done so far so uh, let me put this up and then i'm gonna turn around so that you can see what i have done so far So this is what I've done so far. Let me take this out of the way. I haven't done this yet. Right. Right here and right here, I've done this so far. And as you can see, the difference between what I just showed you and ideally what I wanted. So I'm going to take one of them out and then just do a close-up. So you, as you can see, I pull it from the root. And I hope you can see that. I put the extension from the root, from my hair root, and then continued all the way down so the size is a little bit more uniform than um it, it the rest of the ear currently is and that's my that's that's the goal that i want also what i did too was some of them was still a little bit too big 
So I went ahead and I adjusted the size as you can see. I'm still trying to see if I can get that goal of um, five, 500. And so this is what I have so, so far. Um, apart from that, I love them. I mean, I think they're beautiful. Um, I did wash it already um, because she used the gel to secure, no, no, to make the parts, I, I guess, a little bit more crisp. And I just didn't like the feel afterwards. So I just, I braided and banded it and, um, and just wash it out. I use the tea, the tea tingle, um, tea tingle tea tree tingle shampoo this is what i use to wash it for the ends my ends i use the coconut the the cantu shea butter for naturally here coconut curling cream and it gives me a really nice curl definition and um and then if i want to refresh the curls i just use the next day curl reactivator and so far it's been working pretty pretty good for my scalp, I'm using the the, the um, Lux Sanity Cinnamon Mint Eucalyptus Scalp Soothing and Conditioning Spray. And so far, it has been helping me with the itching because when I just started, after she's first finished, um, the itching was really insane. But this really, really helped to calm my the itching to calm the scalp down. I also am using. Um, Richard store organic castor oil and I'm just putting this on my scalp um, as needed as needed so as needed so stay follow me on my journey of this new set of locks I really want to see um, where it will take me how long they will last and um, how long the curls will hold up you know before I have to change them I am hoping I'll have them for like uh, three years <laughs> yeah because i plan to the, when my the more my hair grow i plan to like cut so what i will do is after three years or two and a, or two years take these curls down snip off some of the the, the 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 ends and then replace them with new curls so but so far i have been loving it the curl the, it's really really beautiful and i just got this because when i washed my hair i let it stay in the braid um and dry so when i pull it out i am and this is what i'm left with which is pretty good so follow me on my channel if you want to see how this progresses i'm going to try to give month by month um progress on everything that i do and i'll show you the final result after i adjust all of these all of these so that you can see there will not be much difference really you know but still i wanted to share that with you so thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and for following me like and share with a friend bye bye